Philadelphia's Pride Festival is back starting this weekend. This year marks the 50th anniversary of the city's first Gay Pride Day. Yeah, the month-long celebration will honor the many activists and community members who have fought for equality for the LGBT community. Here's our Hank Flynn. This is our first Pride and we're super excited about it. Rom Christian and his partners have put the finishing touches on Cockatoo, their new restaurant at 13th and Chancellor, mural arts, painting and all. Philly Pride comes in this weekend. They've hired DJs, performers, they're expecting throngs. It's the first Pride since the pandemic. New organizers emphasize black and brown pride. But the reality is that this is an attempt to bring black and brown people forward talk about minorities, talk about what we do as a community, and ensure that everybody has a voice in, in what's going on. Pride started Thursday in Gaberhood, but people were working and things hadn't gotten cooking yet. So mid-afternoon showers chasing people off, I picked up the phone. Yes, we still have to protest. Yes, we still have to march. I still do all of that work. Deja Alavez just finished running for state representative. When we spoke, she defended Pride's old organizers, who she says got a raw deal. I that it was always diversive and always inclusive and it was centered on community and so therefore I don't know what to expect with this one. Alavez says she remembers getting beaten just for walking down the street transgender. That experience and those of other older leaders will all be crucial, she says, in the face of bills and state houses nationwide that threaten LGBTQ civil liberties. I just think that we as a community have to figure out a better way. We do not have to continue to tear down the people that came before us, the things that came before us. We need to find a way to respect that, celebrate that, and still continue to work on making change. She's hoping for a celebration. She adds, since she says the struggle happens every other day of the year, new organizers and the first real Philly Pride in a couple of years runs through the weekend, drop on by. It's always been fun, and there's plenty to learn. I'm Hank, and that's my take.